Previously on Detroit Become Human. Do something for me. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Trust me. Try to imagine something that doesn't exist, something you've never seen. Now concentrate on how it makes you feel. Wow, it's making And let your hand load. drift across the canvas. Yeah, see? Yeah. Oh, what a burger, dude. That's how you sample shit? Oh, Jesus, what the hell are you doing? I'm analyzing the blood. It's here, Lieutenant! I don't even have a choice. Oh, shit. Chris, Ben, get your asses in here now! Come on! What are you gonna do? You gonna shoot me, is that it? Are you gonna shoot a human? <laughs> Uh-oh, someone's sleepy. And so we continue. Man, I really hope I'm making the correct uh, choices. <laughs> I mean, there's no correct, right? It's just how I feel. I warned him twice, you know? I ain't gonna warn him the third time. Look, it's raining, that's right. They said so on the news. Who am I? Oh, it's gonna be Kara, the bus, right? Thank you for using oh, it's not. Oh, it is. All right. End of the line. End of the line. Yeah, you're gonna have to leave. Good morning. We have to go. I see the plastic that I have in the front. Um, the, the blood came off. Do you know if there's any other place we could spend the night? Oh yeah, I could turn like that. Look at the water droplets and stuff. Uh oh, she's cold. Are you okay? She is soaked. We'll find somewhere to spend the night. Let's go. Damn, the quality is fucking ridiculous. Thing. That's a shelter thingy for other people. Come on, I could just walk. hurry. I could walk on the thing. I could. Oh, we need a place to stay. Do you know anywhere we could spend the night? Wow. Okay. Ooh, that's pretty cheap. That's pretty fucking cheap. That's pretty fucking cheap, dude. Ooh. Shop is closed. Okay, what's that? But discreet. Comfort, but safe. How to get in? You will need money. 
when open before morning. Can't stay. Uh, can I ask for help? No. I don't want to go to the shop. I don't know about that, dude. Let's go over here. Let's see if there's like new. Oh, never mind. There's a news thingy. I mean, nobody works at this thing, right? It's warm in here. You'll feel better in no time. Oh, yes. See, that's the smartest thing to do. Totally forgot about that. I just killed somebody. Okay, I'll, I'll listen to you. Whatever you want, kid. I would have stolen. Right. We won't do it, okay? She needs the morale type thing, right? I guess killing your dad is fine, but not uh <laughs> killing your dad is fine, right? Uh-oh, dealing to disaster. Oh shit. Well, isn't that like right now, dude? Like pesticides are killing bees as we speak. Like like they're becoming endangered. Soon we're all gonna just have fake honey and shit. <laughs> you need everyone kills bees. The one that you gotta kill is like hornets and them shits. Sir, your laundry is complete. Let me help you. I don't want to steal it. I just wanted to put it inside the basket. I like how there's those you can just look everywhere. Okay. Well, it's time for you to get soaked again. Okay, let's see what the hell else is there. That's it. That's it. I really wish it was a first person so I could see it. What you looking at? Come on, let's go. That sucks. So that was just for that? Oh my god, okay. Go tell later. I'm not so cold. You look lost. We have nowhere to go. I know someone who can help you. But that's on the other side of town. We need a place for tonight.
What? Come on, Alice. Thank you for using Detroit buses. At least we got the connection to the next area or whatever. Look, the store is still open. Maybe we should go inside. At least you'll be out of the cold. It actually tells me something after? So I just look at stuff for a long time? I don't have any money. What do you want? Forget it. Get out of here. Never mind. I'm with a little girl, and we have nowhere to go. Could you spare some money so we can get a room for tonight? Shit. A homeless android? Ah, that's the best yet. Look, this is a convenience store, not the Salvation Army, okay? You better go if you're not gonna buy anything. Gotta have a gun. Don't rob. That's not needed. I'm just making more of them. They're gonna be like, yeah, I saw her. But it's alright, we're gonna go to the other side of the town. But she needs some clothes. She needs like a rain poncho. It's like the most sketchiest fucking thing. Not as bad as this fucking... Oh, man. Alright, so she doesn't want me to be bad, so I won't be bad. Okay, so it doesn't always do it. An abandoned house. At least we'd be out of the rain. Here we go. Time to get Cara, a reason. I don't like this place. Okay. I know. But it's just for one night, and no one will look for us here. Never mind, trespassers will be prosecuted. Okay. She doesn't like it, we're not going there. We're sleeping in the car then, how about that? Is the, is the car okay? This is private property, but what about this? She's not saying nothing with this one. We don't have any money for the fucking. I don't want them to have a paper trail over to the fucking motel and they go, oh, yeah, I saw that android or something like that. What the fuck is that racket? Oh, it's a fuck. It's a bus. What's this? Ooh. She has the tools. It looks abandoned. No, don't break anything. Just wait. That's like pointless. Did you try the handle? <laughs> you didn't try the handle? God damn it. Is that really it? There's another back way to the fucking. Oh, if I cut through the front way, they would have saw, huh? Here, let me just check this out, then. Snip, snip. She got the android strength. I lied to you when you said that you didn't want to go here. Because we're going! Like, because <laughs> we're going! Are you alright? Yes, it's just a scratch. Be careful.
Oh, well, I guess she trusts me now, right? She's gonna Don't get worry, sick. We're just having a look. The house seems like the best one, dude. Up here? Oh, I'm thinking too much of climb the vines and shit. Just making sure, dude. Nazi zombie style. Look. I should have stole the fucking clothes. We already killed somebody, man. Ah, oh, fuck it. Alice? Alice! Wait, what are you doing? Visitors. Ralph doesn't like visitors, they're nasty. They may hurt Ralph. Andrew. Look, I'm an Android too. You have nothing to be afraid of. All we want is a place to spend the night. Visitors are dangerous. Look. What they did to Ralph. Okay. Just leave. We're leaving. So you'll be safe again. Come here, Alice. <laughs> So now we're fucked. I should have just fucked in Thingdom. I just don't want to do anything bad. It feels like we it's have okay. to find somewhere, anywhere, just a place to spend the night. Hang on, Alice. We'll find something. I promise. We're staying in here then. Stand back, Alice. Doing the chaotic good. Nobody will find us here. I don't want to sleep in there. Can't we find a better place? We don't have a choice. Okay. We'll find somewhere better. Look at me, dude. What else is in here? Is there something in the... I'm really getting... I'm fucking up here. I'm regretting my choices now. Since we can't find thing, we're stealing the clothes. Fuck it. Sorry, but you're just gonna sleep outside in the in the rain. How about that? We're just sleeping in the rain now. There's no fucking choice. So we're stealing some some clothes. You need it now. Fucking stealing, dude. This is fucking that's too much, man. What, you're just gonna rob this man like crazy, dude? I wasn't thinking about this. Wow. 99 fucking... 
thief skill. Sorry, Alice, but your fucking thing, you're... Why don't we leave, you know? How about we leave? She could hide her thingy now. Yeah, now we look cute. Nobody knows she's an android now. Yeah, now she's warm. Let's go check this motel out, then. We need $40. I'm not an android. Don't trip. We're not going in? You can't, Alice. I don't have any money. We have to find $40. Or go somewhere else. <laughs> no wife in the club. Give me $40. How about we fucking take it from someone now? Do something. Oh, fuck. Oh, what the fuck was that? What the fuck are you doing? We got that black dude right there. He's like, man, you better... Okay, it's, it's, okay stop it. Look, I'm pressing up. I press up. There we go, finally. Jesus Christ. I guess we gotta sleep in the car, dude. I'm glad I got this clothing. It's better now. I don't want to rob the guy. We sleep in the car. Sorry, there's no choice. I don't want to make make it so that it's like I'm gonna cause problems. I want to be alive at the end, not a renegade fucking killer android. So I just stole clothes, so... That's no problem. Sorry, you're sleeping in the car tonight. At least you're warm. We're sleeping in the car tonight. Look at all that mold. We stay here. We're better off staying, Alice. The important thing is for us to be safe. And it's just for tonight. Now my girl looks like fucking Chloe mixed with Max. <laughs> Chloe mixed with Max. Her beanie. I got you. Am I warm? Wow. Here, let's put this moldy ass thing on you. he ever love me? Why was he always so upset with me? And he was all that dust. All I wanted was a life like other girls. Maybe I did something wrong. Maybe I wasn't good enough. No, don't say That's that. That's why he was always so angry. Don't say that. Let me answer. I just wanted us to be a family. I just wanted him to love me. Can we just be happy? I don't know, Alice. You'll never leave me, right? Promise you'll never go. I can't promise, but I'll promise. I promise. Will we be together forever? Forever. Forever. And we gotta leave the country then. <laughs> what the heck are we gonna do now? And this two women stuff? Not it's a woman android?
I felt like the tweaker was gonna give me my position away. That's why I didn't want to do anything. What the fuck is going on, dude? Uh, leave squat. Oh, inside squat. Inside the super mock, and then that's it. I didn't want to rob the place. Yeah, it's everything I did. Where's the stats? World stats there. Now. World star. Yeah, fuck it. I stole the clothes. That's the one I did. I know other people probably think that's so freaking sketch, man. Even Ethan Mars got caught in the motel, that's why I don't want to go. What the fuck is going on? Holy shit! Fucking Kano. Where am I? Corrupted Mind Palace. Low power mode. Defective. Oh god, I'm missing a limb, dude. Oh, everything is fucked. So I'm better off as trash? Oh, fuck! Fucking dare to be stupid, Transformers 80s movie now. Run up to mini bomb! <laughs> universal <laughs> universal greeting, whatever. The trash transformers that would scavenge from spare parts. Slash uh, Signalis. The TE900 is compatible with me. Who am I? I thought I was the the cop, but I don't think so. Or the detective. Because he's bald, but I don't know if his hair just fucking... This is a woman's leg like that. Damn, there's a whole other body and shit. DC 900, so I'm getting like multiple parts, dude. Chimera. Artificial heart is that I gotta hold it. What the hell is going on, dude? Who am I? I look like the detective. Shit. There's a place where we can be free. Find Jericho! Find Jericho! How the fuck is this out of the junkyard? Damn, you know what's funny? You could never find a human body in all these damn parts, dude. Like the 
perfect place to hide a body until it decomposes and shit. Yeah? Where are you going? Oh god, we're gonna fight everyone? Ready to fight the... stuff from you like that. Fuck. It's in the middle of the chest. This is bullshit like that. Why don't you get it from one of those guys, the one that are moving? You fucking asshole. Oh god, okay, so it doesn't even scan. My shit's all fucked up. Look over here, I saw some stuff. Yeah, it's all fucked up, the scanning. What about these fresh ones? I can't check out the fresh ones. Like it's compatible. Regulator, what the fuck is that? I have a feeling I have no choice but to kill that lady. Oh, it's like here. The screeches, dude. <laughs> Fuck me, I should have never. Oh, damn it. Should have did that last or something. We just need that. Hello. I'm an AK-700 android. I was designed to serve you. What can I do for you? Give me your Hello. eyes. I'm an AK-700 android. My program has detected an anomaly. Please contact your nearest cyber life maintenance team.
Is that pump regulator, that chest thing? Wow, well, we got the Japanese going on. saw his like pretty boy right eye or whatever left eye whatever is it fucking what's his name I can't see shit dude what am I looking at oh fried body dude car wreck am I Marcus there you go I was trying to figure out his name I was like what the fuck is his name again am I Marcus what happened to my hair dude Am I Marcus? I thought I was the first guy, the very first guy, but I can see I'm Marcus. It took me a while to figure out who, who, which one I am. At least I can scan and shit now. That's the only one I can have no choice. I don't want to take it from her. You gotta get it from the ones that are crazy. Like the incoherent ones. I mean everyone else is climbing. Yeah, see? I could have just got it from this person. Didn't have to kill the fucking other lady. I figured there's so many fucking things there. It has to be. How does this work? How am I still good? I guess it's because my heart is okay. Holy shit, I can feel the pumping, the vibration. Holy shit, I'm like red, pink. Oh, there's a fucking controller color. I didn't even notice. Climb the slope. It's just worse than it looks because it's fucking raining. Here we go, fucking. Norman, Norman Jaden, <laughs> like this, I'm like, shit. I have a feeling when Norman Jaden is slow. I think he's gonna Norman Jaden it. You know what? I have no idea who he fucking is anymore. <laughs> I thought this was Marcus. I guess not, dude. Holy shit, are you sure about that? There's no choice, dude. Alright, you're cool, dude. I'm Marcus, right? My name is Marcus. 
<laughs> Damn. I didn't know I'm playing Fallout now. Quantum Dreams isn't a quantum dream game without any a little bit of heavy rain or snow. Heavy rain and snow, dude. Oh, there's different choices. I knew it was Marcus. I couldn't tell from the beginning, actually. I didn't know if it was him or not. I was like, who's this fucking guy that looks like the dude from uh, <laughs> Prison Break? <laughs> I didn't know I'm the Prison Break guy. Because he's not wearing his outfit. That's probably why I don't know. Here's the detective. Which dies at the end or whatever. Amanda, can I step on here? Let me step on the Zen Garden. Hmm. I want to step on the Zen Garden is what I'm trying to do. Oh. See a lot of birds. I think she's in this middle place. Oh, there she is. All right, so I'm gonna walk around. There better not have been like a um, ooh, a magazine in that other place in the trash can or something. The hell was that? Got the lily pads. Another way to the middle. There's a lot of birds in this bitch. Those doves? Pigeons? Oh, I could go over here. Who's buried here? What is this gravestone? That's obviously a, a robot. <laughs> Did it have a name or was it just all like a registration I serial number and shit? I'm gonna go fucking mess with this bonsai real quick. I wish it was first person, man. This thing looks so beautiful. Like, I guess we're gonna go on a boat ride. Amanda? Hello, Amanda. Connor. It's good to see you. Congratulations, Connor. Finding that deviant was far from easy. And the way you interrogated it was very clever. You've been remarkably efficient, Connor. Thank you, Amanda. We've asked the DPD to transfer it to us for further study. It may teach us something about what happened. The interrogation seemed challenging. What did you think of the deviant? Uh, traumatized. It showed signs of PTSD after being abused by its owner. As if its original program had been completely replaced by new instructions. This 
Lieutenant Anderson has been officially assigned to the deviancy case. What do you make of him? Uh, intriguing. I think he's irritable and socially challenged. But he's a good detective. But I also think he used to be a good detective. Yeah, that's what I think so too. He's like an the... intriguing character. Stereotypical one from Unfortunately, shows. Unfortunately, we have no choice but to work with him. What do you think is the best approach? Uh, adapt. I will adapt to his personality. It is in the best interest of the investigation that I avoid conflict and try to accommodate his psychology. More and more androids show signs of deviancy. There are millions in circulation. If they become unstable, the consequences will be disastrous. You're the most advanced prototype Cyberlife has ever created. If anyone can figure out what's happening, it's you. You can count on me, Amanda. Hurry, Connor. There's little time. Am I a different robot from the one from the beginning? What the hell's Hank? Can I help you? I'm here to see Lieutenant Anderson. Do you have authorization? Yes. Hello, cutie. <laughs> Lucy Liu in this motherfucker. Lieutenant Anderson hasn't arrived yet, but you can wait at his desk. Lucy Lubot. <laughs> Lucy Lubot. Futurama. Lucy Lubot. Tensions in the Arctic have reached a new level, with a Russian carrier and an American patrol boat reported to have clashed last night. Several warning shots were exchanged, apparently with no damage or casualties to either side. You might be in shock. Just the Minister for Defense, easy. Dennis Riggs, yeah. has spoken. Is it trying to make me learn this thing? Of intolerable provocation that cannot days? go unanswered. Sure. The countries in the region, particularly Sweden and Canada, have called for military forces to withdraw and an international conference to be held. There you so go. So far, there has been no Thanks. response from either Moscow or Washington. I needed that. We'll keep you informed minute by minute it as the situation long, develops. What is this from? Oh, I can go in. I'm an idiot. Oh, look, at the, look at that big cop. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Just relax. Just tell him what happened. Shit, let's look at all these again. This doesn't look like, like real people scans, it looks like they're just character creation. The other one was real people scans though. It's obviously not him. Oh, it's right here. Excuse me. Do you know what time Lieutenant Anderson usually arrives? Depends on where he was the night before. If we're lucky, we'll see him before noon. Thanks. His voice. What accent is that? Is that the one I have to sit down? Oh man, 
He's like, I'll explore the office. Yeah, he's not coming. Listen. Wow. Listening to that 2021. Taste cold, traces of caffeine. A dead tree. Japanese maple. And donuts. Damn, 51 grams of carbs? God damn, just one donut. No oh, antihydrous. Where it was before, wasn't it? The Jimmy's. Oh my god, it's dogs! A St. Bernard? <laughs> it's funny, you'd find my me. My dog's hair is everywhere, dude. Ice task force? They're all red eyes. That third guy looks familiar, dude. Well, I don't even see him. Is he even in that pic? Dealers. Oh, there he is right there. I see him now. Didn't matter though, because there's so much red eyes. That's why everybody knows him. It's good to see you again, Lieutenant. Oh, Jesus. Hank! In my office! He's already gonna get thing. Can I come inside? I've got 10 new cases involving androids on my desk every day. Wow, Air Force. We've always had isolated incidents. Old ladies losing their android maids and that kind of crap. But now, we're getting reports of assaults and even homicide like that guy last night. This isn't just CyberLife's problem anymore. It's now a criminal investigation, and we've got to deal with it before the shit hits the fan. I want you to investigate these cases and see if there's any link. Why me? Why do I got to be the one to deal with this shit? <laughs> I am the least qualified cop in the country to handle this case. I know jack shit about androids, Jeffrey. I can barely change the settings on my own phone. Everybody's overloaded. I think you're perfectly qualified for this type of investigation. Bullshit! The truth is, nobody wants to investigate these fucking androids, and you let me hold in the bag. CyberLife sent over this android to help with the investigation. It's a state-of-the-art prototype. It'll act as your partner. No fucking way. I don't need a partner, and certainly not this plastic prick. Hank, you are seriously starting to piss me off. You are a police lieutenant. You are supposed to do what I say and shut your goddamn mouth. You know what my goddamn mouth has to say to you? Okay. Huh? Okay. I'll pretend like I didn't hear that. So I don't have to add any more pages to your disciplinary folder, because it already looks like a fucking novel. This conversation is over. Jeffrey, Jesus Christ, why are you doing this to me? You know how much I hate these fucking things. Why are you doing this to me? Listen, I've had just about enough of your bitch. Either you do your job or you hand in your badge. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got work to do. Damn. Uh. I'm very pleased to have joined the team. <laughs> I can assure you I'll do my very Close best. Close the door on your way out. 
<laughs> he thinks I'm like a regular. Have a nice day, Captain. Yeah, he thinks I'm just like a regular android. I, I don't want to. I wonder if there's anything else. I don't wanna do anything. Ooh, I found something fancy. Let him cool off. Supposed to be like Good Morning America or something? Who is this? Yet. You don't like me, but we're going to have to work together. We'll both have to make an effort. Now that we're partners, it would be great to get to know each other better. Is there a desk anywhere I could use? No one's using that one. At least it's not a fucking shed area, closet room, whatever. You have a dog, right? How do you know that? The dog hair's on your chair. I like dogs. What's your dog's name? What's it to you? My dog's name is Mary. Sumo. Oh, Sumo. <laughs> Call him Sumo. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool, dude. Really I don't know, you metal listen music. to Knights of the Black Death? I really like that music. It's full of energy. You listen to heavy metal? Well, I don't really listen to music as such, but I'd like to. How fast you You're a Detroit Gears fan, right? Denton Carter scored 53% of his shots from the three-point line yesterday. Did you see the game? That's what I was watching at the bar last night. Oh. Aw, oh, damn it. Have you known Captain Fowler for long? Yeah. Too long. I was wondering, do you always arrive at the office at this time? I arrive when I arrive. Stop That's how good busting he is. my balls, okay? That's how good he is. I do the anti android stuff. I don't feel like doing If that. you have any files on Deviants, I'd like to take a look at them. Terminal's on your desk. Knock yourself out. To work, we return to work. We found no trace of a break in. What's that? What's that button? Up, down. What is that? Analog stick? Oh, it's the right analog stick. What happened? Oh, this is Gordon Lopez. What the heck? A disappearance. I see. Charles Bell, an attack. All this is Lieutenant Anderson. 
Team V series. Strangle him. I'm looking at his name. Taking flight. There's so many. Uh oh. Uh oh. Somebody didn't want to be no more sex android, dude. Oh, the prototype. Holy shit. This is the one that thing. What is it? Marcus. Solved. Oh! I mean, they call the emergency service. Is that it? Yeah, okay, let's scan everything else. 243 files. God damn! First dates back nine months. It all started in Detroit and quickly spread across the country. An AX-400 is reported to have murdered a man last night. That could be a good starting point for our investigation. I understand you're facing personal issues, Lieutenant. But you need to move past them, and- Hey, don't talk to me like you know me. I'm not your friend, and I don't need your advice, okay? I'm going to file a report with my superiors that you refuse to work on this investigation. That was a whack. I wanted him to threaten so I have feelings. Listen, asshole. If it was up to me, I'd throw the lot of you in a dumpster and set a match to it. So stop pissing me off. But things are gonna get nasty. Uh, Lieutenant? I'm sorry to disturb you. I have some information on the AX-400 that killed the guy last night. It's been sighted in the Ravendale district. I'm on it. That was like a shitty, shitty thing, dude. Alright Dexter, JR wanted me to give you a little shout out. He says to call you a bastard, but I've never met you. You might be perfectly nice for all I know, you bastard. Like, comment and subscribe, or I'll break your fucking legs.